Hey everyone, welcome back to new content of Cyber Browser. So in today's video, we will look into the revamp in the price list. So let's dive into the sales module and from the configuration settings, we can just enable the price list. So we know till uh, the previous version, Udo 17, we have uh, different types of price lists such as advanced price lists as well as uh, multiple prices per product. But as you just move on to the Odoo 18 here, you can see that we can just set multiple prices per product and automate discounts. And actually all those are managed with a single price list. So here you can either configure the price list from uh, this section or you can just go to the products and choose the price list. So afterwards you would be able to find all the price lists that is configured and you can see the name of the price list, the country group. The currency that is applied in the price list as well as the selectable field so selectable fields is nothing but if you want to just select this price list in the website you can just enable this field and you can see that this price list uh, comes under the website uh, uh, my website so if you are sitting any other website then this will be available for that website also we can also make this um, single price list available in multiple uh, websites and all these websites um, i mean all these price list comes under the company, uh, my company is San Francisco. Now let's see how can we create a new price list. So I'm going to create a new price li list. Uh, let's name it as demo price list. And here you can see that the currency applied in this price list as well as you can find a, a country group field over here. So till uh, Odoo 17, you know, country group is a field that we found under the configuration tab. So in Odoo 18, we don't have a configuration tab over here. Instead, uh, the field that is uh, just moved and placed in the price list interface, I mean, out of the uh, configuration tab or uh, it's just in the interface of the price list uh, near to the currency. And now you can just set uh, the price list rules over there. So if you want to add any line, you can just click on add a line. And here you can see that we can just apply uh, this price list on a particular product or with a particular category. So if you want to choose any particular category, then you can only apply this price list for a particular category. And if you want to just go with the product, then this, this uh, price list can be only applied for a particular product. Um, you cannot apply a particular price list for a product and category um, uh, from a single uh, price list or from a single rule. You can just create multiple rules in same um, price list and apply. Uh, both these conditions and all. Now here you can see that we have different price types uh, that is discounts, formula, fixed price and all. So I'm going to set it as a discount and here you can see that we can just set the discount over here. I'll be applying uh, a 10% of discount and if you want to choose any particular sales price from here, you can also choose that. So um, actually we know, till all 17, we know that we had two types of price list that is the advanced price list as well as uh, multiple prices per, per product but all those just combined and made into a single price list over here now if you want to manage with the uh, formula you can see we will get other tabs over here uh, we can set the uh, based price it can be uh, sales price cost or other price and you can also use the discounts or round of two and extra charges or you can also just go with the fixed prices over here now, let me just go with the uh, thing uh, that is the discount. So, I'll be applying 10% of discount. Later on, you can save this and close that. And uh, if you want to set any uh, minimum quantity and maximum quantity and all, you can set that as well as the start date and end date, which defines the validity of this price list. And here you can see a field, uh, not a field, a tab called e-commerce. So, uh, till Odo is ended, we know e-commerce where is section that's available under the configuration tab. So currently we can uh, manage the price list for an e-commerce through a separate tab. So that is the other change that we can find under the price list. So I'm going to create a new quotation in order to apply this price list. So you can just go with new button and let's fill out the details of the customer. My customer is John Wills as usual and I'll be choosing the price list which is the demo price list and later on you can go with the product. So I'm going to choose a product as Equistic Block Screen. So here you can see that currently we have just applied uh, the price. Uh, uh, I mean, we have just applied the price list uh, on this product and you can find uh, the um, price of the product over here. So let me uh, click on confirm and here you can see the amount is just applied over here. 
So as you just move on to the unit price, you can find the unit price is just two ninety five. That is the sales price of the product. But upon uh, the applying of the uh, discount for this product, you can see the amount is just turned into two sixty five, and that's how we just manage with the prices in um Odo eighteen uh, sales module. And here we have just noticed the slight revamp in the price list. Now what we have to discuss is that. You can just move on to the price list again and under the price list we can find a button called print and there is also slight changes that you can find and let me just move on to print this price list and here you can see that uh, now you can just select any particular price um, i mean uh, add products to the price list report and get uh, that so i'll be choosing a product over here so let me select that and let me click on select so if you want to find any, uh, uh, I mean, uh, want to know uh, the reports of this price list, you can also easily find that. And here we have a button called add a product that simply adds a product into our report of the price list. So these are the changes that you can find in uh, uh, the Odo 18 uh, price list. And that's all for today. Thank you for watching the video.